Uh, we've pretty much got power generation done. Um, not really a whole lot we need that does a lot of power consumption, unfortunately. Yeah. That's actually something we're missing. That's something maybe to look into at 1.9 would be uh, some more things that make good use of the uh, big reactor. Because, I mean, that mining drill was great and all, but it kind of became obsolete really fast. If you know what I mean. Yeah. Um, actually, the other alternative is to not do big reactors if we don't need anything that it powers. That's true. That is true, actually. We'll, we'll have to see what comes out. I mean, 1.9 is a whole new world. We just don't know what we're going to see yet. I am excited about the combat system because I can't wait until the Slime Knights that do Tinker's Construct gets a hold of offhand weapons. That's got some serious possibilities for uh, the way the game's going to work going forward. Certainly, uh, trade-off in terms of what you're carrying will be is, is all only can only be good. Yeah, and uh, especially how it works. I mean, you could literally be running around with, like, a sword mm -hmm. in your on hand and then, like, uh, torches in your off hand. Yeah. Actually, you know what? I've got a, I've got a project we can work on. Okay. Let's make the uh, um, staff core of the primal. Ooh. Oh my. Yeah. So we've got a series of infusions to do uh, that require a whole wide variety of different um, uh, aspects. As fact, is think, to be expected. I think. In fact, I think there's a few here we don't have access to yet. Um, let me just go through the uh, wands that we need to create. Or the staff cores, I should say. I think it's staff cores, isn't it? It's got to be staff cores. Yeah, city at uh, the rods. Oh, no, it is the one. Hold on, it is. Oh, right, okay. I remember now. Yeah, it, it uses the same. Okay. So, uh, one of them is Examinus. Uh, this is the skull, the undead one. Um, I'm not sure if we're already making that one. Not yet, no. Where could we get that one from? We could get that from... Oh, we don't actually... All we have are the uh, is something from Ender.io. We don't have a lot of other sources for it. At least nothing that I've identified. Um, shoot, I might actually need the uh, thing that I turned into uh, goggles the other day. That might have been rather foolish of me. Unfortunately, thermometers are not that hard to make. In fact, I think that's one of the few things that can be made and just, yep, there we are. Bones. Bones, oh good, okay. Well, considering we have a thousand of those, we should be good. Uh, that's 10,000, but yeah. Yeah. No, wait, that's not Examinus. That's, um... That's Perdito. Or, sorry, that's that's Death. That's not Undeath. It's the, uh... The Green Skull, not the Grey... Skull, not the Grey Gravestone. Huh. Could be zombie brains. That would not be an unreasonable one. Yep, zombie brain. We've got lots of those too. Okay. Let's just go through the rest of them. So we've got that one dealt with. Um, that's the bone wand core. Reed, we're good. Blaze, we're good. Hold on, do we have bestia, the wolf head? Those were good on. And ice. I don't know if we have ice yet either. Jellum? Jellum. I don't think we have. Jellum 
Um, oh, no, we got Bestia, but we don't have Jellum yet. Yeah, no, Bestia, I think, was eggs. Yeah. Jellum. Um... Probably ice blocks. Yeah, we just need Which actually... can be made in a glacial precipitator. Yeah, well, we might as well get that going. That's one of the things we haven't finished is the uh, whole aspect of making system. Wait a second. Hang on. I want to I'm going to go down to the kitchen. I think we may have something already. Oh yeah. Okay, I'll hold off finishing this thing. I just made all the bits and bobs, but snowballs. Okay, and we've got those on on manufacture or Yes, we have those on tap down in the uh, in the kitchen. All right, we'll just have to figure out how to tap into that. But in the meantime, I've just snagged uh, a stack of snowballs out of our... Yeah, I it just... shouldn't be very difficult to run a, a storage bus out here. Yeah. All right, we need another couple warded jars. All right, so we need one bone... We're making six of these, so one, two, three, four, five, six. You'll also need a, a couple of new drawers, I think. Possibly. These aren't going to be huge numbered items. I believe one's made with obsidian. So bone. One sugar cane, one blaze rod, one obsidian, one ice. I actually do need a piece of ice. Which I don't believe we actually have one yet. Yeah. So we still will need that glacial precipitator because I actually need an oh, ice. Oh, there's, the... there's one in the kitchen. Okay, do you want to just get me uh, one block of ice? Sure. Warded jar as well. So let's see. So block of quartz, uh, blaze rod, and then the ice. We need to balance the shards, and then one of each of the other shards. That goes with that. That'll go with the fire. I'll go with that one. That'll go with the earth. No, that'll go with the order. Let's see if my guesses were right. Obsidian is earth. Ice is water. Blaze Here's your ice. ice. Perfect. Air is the reed and entropy. Yep. Okay. All right. Now we just need to stock up. We're getting between 6 and 12 of every aspect, potentially. So if we just stock up all of the core aspects and make sure there's a little bit extra in the system, we should be okay. Anything that uses a lot of? Ah, uh, Precantio, of course. Stock that right up. Lotus, four more of those. Orm, I don't think we're going to need. Void, might need. Let's see. Talum. Hold on, we don't have the... Do we have the crystal one? What's it called? Um, vitreous. I don't see vitreous here, do I? At least not in the jars. Nope, not yet. Okay. I need a couple more warded jars, Sneaky. Are you able to make those? Uh, let me check. Mm 
What is that under? Th thaumaturgy? Uh, that'll be under, yeah. Um, no, alchemy, I believe. Yeah, alchemy. Ah, here we are. Yes, I can do warded jars and void jars. Perfect. We just need just some plain warded jars, I think. This system's pretty carefully balanced. Not a problem. It's hardly a pain in the glass. Good stuff. I am most pleased to hear that. Yeah, that's a that's a pun because it actually requires glass panes to craft. Right. Yeah, it even does require glass panes. Sorry, I missed the. I knew it required glass, but yeah, glass panes. Oh God, that's even funnier. Awesome. What was that thing I was saying about being a little slow on the uptick right now? Yeah, I think that's a thing. <laughs> <sighs> All right, air. And then the labels, I think, could just be made in the uh, normal. And how many do you need? Um, let's call it four. How about six? Sure. Six is a good number. Any of these need to be warded or avoided? Not, no, I think we'll be okay. If it becomes a problem, we can empty them out and do it later. Here you go. Cool. So I guess today I'm being Soren. I suppose so. That is what he does quite regularly, isn't it? Yeah, Dire Wolf goes, Hey, I need you to make me these. And he's like, okay. That's weird. Examinus, only six? What did I throw in? Maybe I didn't throw that much in. Um, we determined that was coming from brains. Okay. Is that crystallizing system still running or is it? Oh yeah, it's still going, isn't it? Good, okay. I was concerned there for a second, but apparently it's just uh, running a little behind is all. Well, that and there was a, a, an interesting thing about how they were routing was improperly done, and so I have set it up to go more properly. Oh, you, f you fixed it. Okay. So it's it's picking up speed now. Yeah. Ba basically, you have to be careful because this one over here mm -hmm. will try and connect up here. However, the uh, furnace itself requires Terra Aspect to to do things. Ah. And so it eats up most of the Terra Aspect, and, and it's got just enough for these three over here. So mm -hmm. this coming around is actually more efficient for it. Right. Those in there. Let's see. Error has been topped up. All right. New jar. The skull. Okay. I think we can set up the first infusion here. Let's see. So we'll get the book out. Fire beast. Yeah. Okay, we're set up to do the fire one. Fuck fire the daddy. Oh, there's essence in the jar. Yeah. All right. Number one. Now, I'm. Th I don't believe that this one requires. No, it will still require a cap or something, won't it? It will require a pair of caps, actually. Well, um, how does uh, throwing some Ikorium? Yep. 
I don't know if we're going to be able to pull this off, but if we can, it is going to be pretty awesome. You don't think the aquarium will be doable? Um, depends on how much essence it's going to require. Right. Now, we do have the Thaumium Scepter, which has an additional bonus, and with the gear you've got, you sh might be able to reduce it to the point where you can do it, but we may have to do an intermediary project. Mm, something that'll some wand with a little bit more punch to it. Mm, or uh, um, actually a scepter, because remember the ultimate. Right. Ultimately, it's created in the work table, so it's going to be a scepter. We're going to ultimately mm. want. So we'll we'll try it first with the um, with the with the silverwood scepter, which has a hundred and fifty of each essence. Makes sense. Can't help but notice that the whole animations and stuff are all working much better now. Alright. That's two. We'll do the uh, sugarcane one next. Pretty sure I have everything we need for that. Be good to go. Now I know a staff of the primal requires 320 of each aspect prior to discount. Oh, interesting. I just noticed something. The aspects are not visible against the sky. What? The I think there must the, the sky blocks make the uh, aspects floating through the air not visible. That's interesting. Yeah, I think it's something something similar to the whole ice through ice invisibility thing. It's possible. I think they actually fixed that in 1.8 or 1.9, so. Yeah. But you'll be able to see it as the uh Yeah, here comes the Terra. Yeah. If you stand over here and watch, just stand where I am, you'll be able to see it only against the, um... Oh, you were too slow. You're going to have to wait for the next one. Oh, I see it. Yeah, I, I can only see it up against the lamp. Or the, uh, zombie heads. Yeah. Okay. Next is the, uh, we'll do ice next. And then entropy. And then we're going to need two um, of those primal... What's it called? Um, primal charms. Which we should have everything we need for as well. So what is that 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 staff core the aquarium? What was it? What's Sorry. what is the name of what we are creating here? We are creating the staff core of the primal. It's the uh, eldritch staff. I suspect you might not have the research for it. Because you won't have gotten into the Eldritch tab yet, yet I don't think, have you? No, but I'm doing some research on Google. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We ran out of Percancio. Or something. No, there's nothing there. What's going on? What did it run? What? What's it stuck on then? This is the entropy one. Oh, um, Perdito. I thought there was more of it there than that.
All right, go little guys. Be extraordinarily grateful for the sheer stability of our infusion system, that it's not throwing lightning and crap all over the place right now. So, it was sitting there stuck on an infusion for how many minutes, and nothing went wrong. Hooray for stability. Mm-hmm, indeed. Okay. Oh, we still need a Silverwood wand core, too. Which is going to require... Um, Salius... What was that requiring? Been a while since I made silverwood. Oh yeah, all the uh, all the uh, all the core aspects and all the uh, focuses. Okay, apparently it is not possible to craft a primal core with void caps on the staff without having to bump up the scepter first. All right, so we need a next tier scepter. Okay. What's the next tier scepter above the one we're current, the Thaumium embossed uh, silverwood? Would that be uh, Ecorium silverwood or? That's what I'm doing research on. Or void, or could be void. I guess void caps would make sense too, wouldn't they? Let me check and see which one is better. Um, one, two. Actually, hold on. I need these for a whole bunch of a, a things, so let's just get a half stack of each. Just make life a lot easier here. Well, you need void... Um, and no, those aren't void caps. Those are uh, thomium caps to make the aquarium caps. The aquarium caps give it a 20% discount. Okay. Twenty percent. That's that's a fair. And there's bit. also ichor cloth strapped silver wood wand core. Hmm, I don't know if I have the research for that one yet. Which would make sense, I haven't gone down that tree completely yet. That particular wand core requires, looks like a silver wood wand core, two Ecorium Claws, one Ecor, two Salus Mundus, a hundred Perdito, 32 Lux, and 32 of the um, tool aspect. Hold on. It holds a thousand of each type of V. Wow. That's impressive. That's a lot of V. I haven't seen you. Air, fire, water. Fire, water. There we are. One, two. Good stuff. All right, got our new cores. Let's go make the uh, three, four. Okay, so both Void Metal and Ecorium give you the 20% discount on V costs. All right. Now, can you do a Scepter with it? I would, exp I would hope so. Well, regardless, we should be able to make this core today. Oh, excuse me, Icorium, um... 
might actually give up to a 30%. Oh, wow. However, that information says it's requiring a hundred of all aspects for the caps. Um, hmm. And of course, I'm nowhere close to doing either one. Just a little ways off, huh? Just a lot. All right, just, just a bit. Yeah, beautiful. That would incident. Okay, now. What'd you pick up? That would be the Silverwood Wand Core. All right, so. This is where we start getting into really scary territory here. And I think I better make sure I do this right. Okay. Read opposite obsidian. Okay. And then fire opposite water that makes a lot of sense actually scepters do use a, a wand core um, you've got the the thomium wand core try making an ichor cloth wrapped core okay is that what we're doing here nope we're making the actual um, we're making the uh, the core the primal. staff we're making the primal staff core Okay. Because I've, I've got all the parts for it. Um, I'm just getting the aspects gathered, and that'll be a good spot to wrap up the episode. Awesome. Uh, and then we can figure out how to actually have enough to uh, infuse it at a later date, or in the next one. Okay, more fire, more air, more order. More fire, more air. More order. One more time. More air, more order. It's not going to hurt to have extras of this stuff. Okay, fire, we're good. Water, we're a little short on still. Order we're a lot short on. All right, that's enough air. Yeah, water in order. border come on bring us some water guys okay There we go. Water's coming in. That should do it. Okay, here we go. With our new stabil stabilization, we should be fine, but we'll know here in just a minute. He's got to pull 32 of all the core aspects, including Percantio. Oh, 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 64 Percantio. Which is a problem because I'm pretty sure the jar isn't full. That's okay. I can fix that by just. Fortunately, the Percantio is a last essence it pulls, so you have time to refill. Yep. 
No problem. I just threw a full stack in. Um, it's not a void jar, so by the time we're done, there will be a half stack of it in there again. Oh, it looks so pretty with the... Wow! The, um... Earth, the fire, and water can actually find their way there directly. Ooh. They're, they're f I didn't realize they were that close. It's floating up through the floor. I think because of the uh, openings I've created while I was cr with the facades, um, it's actually got a direct air open air route right now that it didn't have before. Nice. So it's actually coming into the altar from below right now. That's pretty cool. Yeah, Precantio is the only one that might not be able to reach that whole distance. Or it might find a closer route through the uh, mirror, which is right in front of it. Hmm. Path yeah. of least resistance? Pretty much, yeah. So far, so good. I love the visual effect here. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It was one of the uh, things that were added that was added that made me decide that uh, Thomcraft would always be a mod that I would have on the server. Oh it's... well, yeah, the Thomcraft has already been released for 1.8, and I can't see Azinor letting any gr grass grow um, under oh, his feet for updating 1.9. Yeah, and it's coming through the mirror, as I suspected. Yep, I can see it um, against the uh, against the heads. Not even a single sh single spike of uh, instability here. Nope. I mean, it's not as unstable as the uh, Ikor-related uh, infusions, so that doesn't surprise me in the slightest. This is probably one of the most absurd things we've ever made, because this, this thing apparently will just recharge itself. And it's got a capacity of about a thousand V. Yeah, something crazy like that. Alright. Now then, Ikorium 1 caps for maximum uh, discount? Yep, which we will start working on in the next episode, because it's been over an hour. We better call it a day. Alright. So in the next episode, we'll take this beastie and we will finish it. Woohoo! Woohoo! Thanks for watching, everyone, and I will see you next time. Bye for now. Take it easy.